I don't know what kind of hope I had for not dying to you. Oh, I hate that. Are you Siren Head? Oh boy! Oh boy! Well, and we're in. I'm not going out there. But this is. Oh, I can turn on the lights outside. Oh, I hate that. I'm gonna turn my audio up a little bit. Ah. Wait, 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 wait. I am sorry, was that intended to happen? I did it! Am I supposed to investigate the sounds? Oh. The, my TV running. Oh, that's horrible. Oh, wait. Was that here before? Am I supposed to investigate the sounds? Oh, doggo! Hi, doggo. Something's got you worked up. I'm not going out there. Okay! Okay? Wait, wait, wait. Oh, no! No, my doggo! No! I can run. Why would you? Come here, girl. Oh, no. No, not my baby. No, the well. Oh. Molly's collar. No! Molly is way too close to Millie. Oh, no. I hate that. Yeah, I hate that even more. Uh, right, right side hand rule, I guess. Unless I see something that's telling me uh, the contrary to that. That is a creepy cavernous space to go through. Big fan of that. Just minus the moisture, I guess. But I mean, it's a well, so. Oh boy, don't do that! What? What the? Where am I? <clears throat> well, that seems fine. Um. Oh, that one opened. Oh, that's cool. That one opened. Oh, there's a lever. I hate you. I hate everything that's going on here. When's the next jump scare gonna happen? Oh... No! No! No... Wait... No! No... No... You did not... Oh! I'm just gonna go back down. I don't need to deal with that, you know? Technically you came from down here, so you can't come down here again, so... 
I don't know what kind of hope I had for not dying to you. Oh, I hate that. Are you Siren Head? Oh boy! I'm in the forest. Somehow there's a wall. I have infinite stamina? Let's just find out if I have infinite stamina. Where am I running? I'm running alongside the wall. Because if anything I would suspect the wall eventually has a break in it. Right? Technically it should. My battery is running low apparently. Oh, what's going on? Oh, there it is. Hi. Hi. You look fun. I guess I'm fine. No bodies were ever found. Police discovered camcorder footage on the 21st. Uh, the footage was never released to the public. Why, I wonder? Okay. I also want to point out... Supposedly there's two endings. So let's... Just see what happens. Hi there, Molly! There's something rumbling. I wonder... What happens... If I just ignore everything that's going on. Oh! Alright, uh, wait, dog statue? There's dog statues that I have to collect? Wait, no, 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 we're not just gonna move forward, game. You just gave me a dog statue. And I wanna know where they are. Is there multiple dog statues around? Are they necessary for the endings? Shut off. One thing's got it all worked up. Molly? Get away from there. Also, where's the rest of the dog statue? I need to find them now. Where is the dog statues? I wonder if there was only like one here and now that I've been released into the uh, rest of the world, there's more dog statues out and about and I need to find wherever I go. Which... Maybe I'm also just... What happens if I just wait here, and not go outside? That's the other option, what if I'm just... Not going? I'm just gonna wait around and see, maybe something happens. Oh! Open up the front door! Find the dog statue. Okay, I have two of five. Can't leave without Molly. So, is there an option to just find Molly and leave? Oh, that would be interesting. Also, what's with the dog statues? Maybe, maybe if I find all of the dog statues, I will find Molly. I'm just gonna leave. Everything's gonna be alright. I hate that Molly's gone. That's not cool. Anyway, I'm gonna have a look around. Hopefully find another dog statue. I mean, I only need three more. How difficult could it be? Here's me hoping, by the way, that the dog statues are not just out and about in a random direction. But actually, in well visible spots because if I have to explore the full area 
check behind every tree to find them that it's gonna be nuisance. Another dog statue behind the well. Okay, three of five. So two left. So something tells me that probably down there is somewhere one. I hope. I hope it's not like a... Oh! Four of five. Okay. That one was obvious as well. And I hope they all kind of behave like that, where they are not stupid, stupidly hidden. Especially since now I'm done in the well. I really would hate that you have to take the correct path to find the dog statue down there. Okay, we're out of the... There it is! 5 out of 5 dog statues. Okay, does that mean... I'm not going back in there. Does that mean I have all 5 dog statues? That that was what I needed for the second ending. Because that would be really nice if that's all I needed. Was just find the dog statues. And you're good. They're just gonna have a little bit of a look-see around out here. I don't know if they thought about making this enclosed. Oh no, that's probably the place we've been running around beforehand. Before that thing gobbled us up. With the walls and everything around it, so I always press the wrong button there. So I have five out of five dog statues. I really, really do hope that that is all I needed to make this somewhat different. Because if that did not change anything, then I'm gonna be upset because I don't know what else I could make differently. Because that's it. It's still bloody. Oh, come on. Come on, game. Do me a solid and give me a different ending. Do me a solid there. I worked so hard to find these dog statues. There you are again. Oh. I have six out of five dog statues. Hi. Am I alright? <gasps> Molly! No? Um... What? I'm sorry. Hey, buddy. Apologies for my odor. There's no shower aboard. You don't smell much better, you know. In fact, the only ancient horror beyond human comprehension in this game is your smell. Rude. I was placed diagonally from that other dog, so it'd be harder to notice we used the same 3D model. Oh, clever. Didn't work though, did it? I wouldn't have realized if you wouldn't have said anything. I'm gonna be totally honest, sorry. What? Huh? What do you want? Buh? I don't have anything to say. No, really. Why do you keep trying to talk to me? Do you think... Uh, do you do this in real life too, weirdo? What? Huh? Anyway. Oh, you thought I had dialogue looped and keep clicking? Wow, you really are a freak. Talking to dogs and you, UFO, in an alternate ending to some dumbass indie horror game? Hey, the, the game was fun! Don't you have any hobbies? That's my hobby, actually. You're committed. You should be committed. Ah, uh, put in a really small, small dark room and poke with sticks for eternity. That's rude. I could say anything and you'll keep reading. You're the type of person who re uh, reorganizes other people's uh, stationery. No, I don't. Yes, you, uh, you should do that thing the guy at the end of the of Pi does. I don't know what the dude does. You should end the movie 
Uh, you should end off the movie by yourself. Does he kill himself? I don't know the movie. I just don't get it. Who even cares what this NPC has to say? I do! There's a lot of love and care put into every single NPC! You apparently. Okay, the programmer is getting bored of writing dumb dialogue now. So I'm gonna rest my dialogue. No, seriously, here we go. What? Huh? What do you want? Huh? Well, at this point, it actually loops. Uh, give me... Anyway, I have one more dog to go through. You're safe from Athasia here. Athasia. We're going to the dark planet. That sounds interesting. The trip will take seven days or one hum human day. Yeah, your ship is a little sparse, but what do you expect from a five minute long indie horror game? You're safe from Athasia. Okay. Not the dark planet. That sounds like fun. Molly? Thank you for always taking care of me, human. Now it's my turn to take care of you. Talk to me again when you're ready to go. Let's go. Let's go, Molly! The dog planet awaits! And then you all flew to the dog planet and you lived a happy life after. Ever after. The end? Well. I can guarantee you 100% that was not what I was expecting to happen there. But I'm happy with it. I honestly would have just thought that Molly in the extra ending would jump in and attack the thing that tries to uh, kill me. That would have been perfectly fine for me that Molly comes to save me. That was over the top. Nonsensical. I like it. Broke me out a little bit of the immersion though. But... Fun. Overall, I liked the game. It was short, but it was concise. And it knew how to tell its story correctly and in a beautiful way. With the time skips and not having you wander along too round... Uh, not having you wander around too long without having any idea where to go. Like seeing the maze down in the well. And just a beautiful setup overall. And again, if you want to have it end with a have a second ending on a more serious note, collect the dog statues and just have Molly jump in there and save you from the monster, which would also be a really good ending. You get reunited with your dog, and you can have an ending that's uh, rooted inside of the universe that you have created. I love the hilariousness of the dumb idea with the dark planet and everything, not gonna lie, but I just say, if you wanna try and keep your uh, second ending inside of the same universe and inside of the same vein of like um, atmosphere and storytelling, then that would be a way to go. Anyway, I enjoyed that a lot, it was fun, it was dumb as well, and it actually got me, because the twin transitions they come out of nowhere and they will get you. So yeah, anyway, I hope you all had a fun time with it. I certainly did. And we'll see all of you next time on the Dark Planet. Now I'm gonna have to look up if there is a game called the Dark Planet and whether or not I can play it next week for you. We'll see. See you then. Bye.